What's been your read on this on this 2024 Padres team with the time that you have been here? Uh, amazing team, amazing team, energy team, and then especially when we play, when we play with these fans to support us, it's amazing. So I'm excited to be here. This is the energy team. I know you're an energy guy. Who else do you identify as the guy that kind of gets things going on the on the bench at all times and in the clubhouse at all times? Uh, this guy, Wade, Manny, Tadis, 100%, and uh, Jackson. Jackson is a, I, everybody knows he's a rookie, but he plays like veteran. He brings a lot of energy, energy to us too. So and now David Peralta, uh, we have we have an excellent group. You knew you knew Manny Machado when you got here. You know Tati. You know Xander Bogarts. What did you know about about Jackson Merrill when you when you got here? I guess I imagine not much since he's a rookie. He's the man. He's the man. Especially when the the game is close, we want to hang hit. When the when I saw the fly ball to the center field, I said he got it. I trust that guy a lot, and then he can hit, he can play defense, he can run, he can do everything. Uh, he's still young, but he got he's starting a beautiful career. Okay, he's so young. He just turned 21 years old. Is it normal for a 21-year-old kid to be as, I'm not sure if the word is brash or maybe confident, but he does not lack for, for any confidence, does he? He's, he's look so confident. He's look amazing. He's, on, he's only 21, and he looks like better, and he looks like 30 years old. Like when I saw him play for first time, when I saw his swing, when I saw him running hard to first base or stalling base, he played like a, a veteran guy, so I love that guy. You know, a couple of weeks ago that Fernando said that he, he he wasn't doing a celebration after a home run because he didn't feel like he has swag. Last night he did he did do it. What are you seeing from Fernando Tatis and how much fun to be around this version of that play? Amazing, amazing. That is, he's, he's, uh, he's the guy to watch. He, uh, everybody want to watch him. He got the swag, he got the flow, he got he got everything, you know. So still like he hit the ball hard, he, he played defense, he can throw. He, it's amazing, especially I'm glad to 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 be here, especially close to him, and then he's amazing. It feels like this team has been kind of hovering either right at 500 or below or just above. What does it take for this team to really, really get going? And do you think you guys are even close to playing your best baseball? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the thing is, uh, it's a lot of guy injury, and uh, but we just still compete. We just still compete, and then we just come here to play baseball and win games. What's your favorite part about being in the city so far? I know it's a lot of change for you and your family, but how much have you enjoyed this process? Uh, I, I enjoy a lot of this prof uh, process because uh, my family is here. Uh, they want to stay with me for uh, one month, so that's one of my best things. If my family is close to me, I'll be fine. And uh, especially if they're healthy, I'll be good too. So, But I enjoy a lot here. I love San Diego. I love the fans. The fans, we got, we got a lot of fans. So I'm excited to play here from them. Thank you, Lisa.